so I've just had my latest Lust Habit bag arrive and I think I think this one's for July so let's get right to it so it comes in a little pink bag like this and it is kind of annoying because I've got quite a few of them now and I'm so over getting them so I'll do the products in order off the card let's pop that down there and I will give you a price, say if it's full sized um, and I'll put a little total up in the corner there so you know the total of the whole bag so let's get to it, so this is a Be A Bombshell the one stick and that is full size so we can open that up and that's just what that packaging looks like now I think this is an indie brand, I'm not 100% sure, I haven't really seen it before. So I take it as it's a lip colour and a blush. That'd be quite an intense blush, it's quite red, I'll swatch it for you. That would be way too intense to be a blush, like I would not use it on my, sti my sticks. I would not use it on my cheeks. Make a nice lip colour, I guess. So the value of that is... $24. So I'll just read out the blurb to you. It's, it's in the colour in Flustered, I think. In Flustered? Yeah, in Flustered. So it is an all-in-one multiple stick with, smooth, with a smooth texture. Apply to, the, to eyelids, cheeks or lips with a perfect pop of colour anywhere. Apply as you would regular eyeshadow, blush or lip gloss. I don't know about using it as an eyeshadow. Like, it's really creamy. It's like would you put a lipstick on your eyes like that? I mean, if you've got quite dark under eye circles, you can use it like under there for people like that. Um, okay, so the next thing is another Bear Bomb Shelf product. I can get it out. It is a full size lip gloss, and that's just the same box packaging. I don't know if I can get it open. Am I might even opening it the wrong way? Right way? There. So the shade is saucy and it just looks like that. I guess it'd be nice to go over the all-in-one stick if you oh that's really pigmented. I didn't expect it to be that pigmented from the um tube. It looks more glittery and it looks like it'd be sheer, but it's really pigmented. Um it's a bit sticky and I've just touched that. So that is their bombshell lip gloss. The value of that is $21. Shade is saucy. And I'll just read out the blurb to you again. A lip gloss formula that offers long lasting colour and high shine. Definitely high shine, very pigmented as well. Apply to top and bottom lips. Well, of course you're going to apply to both lips. Sorry, just had to say that. Why would you apply it to just one part of your lips, you know? Um, for full coverage, for sheer coverage, apply to lower lip only and blot lips together. Okay, well now I get that. I sound like an idiot now. For more colour, apply several coats until it's received desired results. Well, with one coat, I can tell you it's going to be really pigmented anyway. So, the next thing is, now, I'm sorry if I, oops, everything's going everywhere pronounce this wrong. It is the Hikari um, eyeshadow quad. Oh, I don't even know if I can get it open. It is also it is in the shade Zoe. Interesting shade. So that's just what the packaging looks like there. It looks a little bit tacky but those colours are so pretty. Like yeah it's it's really odd to have those four colours together but they actually look really pretty. So, fine room. Ooh. I'm gonna run out of fingers. And. Let's have a look at those. So, that's the purple shade, that's like the gold shade, the shimmer gold shade with black flecks in it. That's just the gold shade and that's the black. They're not overly pigmented, but I do really like them. They're quite cool. So, sorry, I'm just going to grab a tissue and wipe them off my fingers because... I don't want them 
on my fingers. Um, I can tell you they've got a bit of stay power. They're not coming off my fingers very easy. I quite like the purple. It goes to quite a nice, it goes sort of pinky as well and it looks really nice and I'll just smudge that on my dresser. So, um, let's, it is the Hikari eyeshadow quad. The, um, it's full size. The recommended retail price is $22.50. I don't think I'd pay $22.50 for that. Just because it feels quite cheap. But I like the colours. They're not overly pigmented. But yeah, so I'll just read the blurb to you again. High pigment, easy to blend, long lasting eyeshadow. Yeah. That's basically all it says. <laughs> and then it just has the different ones you could get. Um, so... The next thing, now I've used a Paula's Choice product before I got one in one of my earlier um, Lust Habit bags and it was like a skin exfoliator thing and I thought it was really good to begin with and then I just felt like afterwards it just made my skin really congested so, so that is that. Now Paula's Choice Resist Intensity, Intensive Wrinkle Repair Retinol Serum Deluxe Size. Recommended retail price, $52. Are you kidding me? I don't know whether I should keep this because obviously I have no wrinkles. <laughs> I would hope not. I'm only 20. Um, but I might hold on to it depending on how long it lasts. Or I might give it to my mum or my grandmother. They always like products I give them. Um, so an exclusive formula that utilises a propire... Pro oh, sorry. Pro... Pro... Pre... Pro priority, uh, sorry, blend of highly stabilized retinol, potent ex antioxidants, and skin repairing ingredients. Its soothing, silky te texture goes to work immediately to help skin of any age. Okay, I don't think they've written this right. Of any age, look and act younger. Key ingredients: licorice extract. I love licorice. Yum. Like. Does anybody like the black jelly beans? Like, I love the black jelly beans. Just send them all to me, please. Um, Anti-irritant, palm oil, antioxidant, calb extract. Uh, extract, cell communicating ingredients. Interesting, vitamin C, vitamin E. Now, vitamin E is definitely good for anti-aging. I know they eat a lot of eel over in Japan and China because it contains a lot of vine. vitamin E, which... Um, is good for anti-aging and a fun fact is they call eel over there unagi. Um, yeah, so their ingredients look pretty good. I thought it said saliva on one of them, but it was sativa or something. <laughs> Imagine if they gave you saliva. So let's open up that box and have a look. Ooh, that looks very professional. Have a look at that. That looks certainly very expensive. I don't even know if it's going to load. And that's the top there. Just Oh, I don't know if I can figure out how to open it. That's, 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 that's probably too fancy for me. <laughs> um, so, yeah, and I said that was, I said 52, don't I? No, yeah. Um, so the next thing is, now I've already got one of these. Oops. And I love it, is the mask. I'm so sorry if I can't pronounce it. Mask? Mask? It's got, it's like mask with an R in it black eyeliner and I've already got one of these so and I love it so it'll just be a spare is it there it's quite a nice black liner so certified organic eyeliner pitch black the recommended retail price of that is $33.50 which is quite a lot for a black eyeliner I usually just go for the cheaper brands mask Certified organic eyeliners can be worn all day and night and they won't slip off the eye. Each eyeliner is made from delicious organic ingredients and cruelty free. Now I'm not going to read out the ingredients because there's quite a lot there. Um, for lasting power, since I already have one and I know how it works, I generally use it on my tight line and it does, I wouldn't say it lasts um, a long time. Now when I use it on my bottom lashes, it does last, and it doesn't smudge, like it will smudge if you want to obviously, but yeah, no, it's really good. So there's one more product, now this is a bonus, and I don't even know if I can get this out of the bag, 
is the now I've seen on Facebook recently and it's a new shampoo by Garnier Fructus and I actually use the orange ones the um, repair Garnier Fructus ones so it's just a deluxe sample and bonus Garnier Fructus full and luscious shampoo and conditioner so the um, I don't know if there's any points on the recommended retail price for the sample it is $5.95 so this is the new one I've been hearing them about and I don't even know if I can open that it's got a I'm definitely going to try this one when it comes out in the supermarkets if it's not already there because Garnier Fructose is so good I love the smell of it and like I found after a while a lot of other shampoo and conditioners like they would still make my hair my hair would still feel like quite greasy and I'd feel so gross so oh there's a whole set of stuff there's a prep which is the shampoo and conditioner treat on damp hair leave-in serum and a volume booster spray so I don't know if you'll be able to see all those so that's just that and oh free luscious and texturizing spray when you purchase 250ml full luscious and oh awesome I don't think we have all with the New Zealand though do we I don't think we're here for a while so I've got to be go, go to Woolworths to use that so those are the samples there and they are pretty decent sized samples so I will definitely be using them so my total thoughts on um, this bag is I have had better ones I'm not too fond of the beer bon bombshell brand I just feel like it's quite cheap and the last few I have had I feel like the products have been quite cheap like there's nothing obviously common like there's no other brands um, like when I've been subscribed to Goody Box or Violet Box I've had like Maybelline and that sort of stuff like this is an Australian bag and I'm you know it could be better it has it's not as disappointing as some of the other ones because with Violet Box and Goody Box you know sometimes you can get, you get a lot more like full size that's why I like it but I usually do find that I don't use the products whereas in Violet Box and Goody Box I will use the products so I mean it's a bit of a hard thing I don't think I'll be getting it again, this will be my last one, um, I mean I wasn't even expecting this one because I had actually already um, taken off my subscription so I was quite shocked when it turned up today. But anyway, thank you for watching and talk to you next time, bye!